Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, so if you haven't noticed already, this is not the eye look that I will be filming in today's video. Um, I actually completely forgot to film an intro for this video, so I'm hopping on again right now just to um, give you a kind of rundown on what's what before we get into the video. So first off, hi. Welcome back to my channel. If it's your first time, welcome. My name is Suzanne. This is Neatly Nailed. And today I'm going to be doing a step-by-step -step tutorial on this eye look right here. And I wanted to film a video um, in real time, step-by-step -step of me just putting together a glam look that people can follow. Um, yeah. That's about it. So I haven't cut anything out. It's all one step right after the next. If for some reason it feels um, chopped or like discontinuous, it's because like I had to pause to go into the next room or something like that. But anytime I am actually um, doing steps on my eyes, I am filming. And it was great because it didn't take too long to do it all. I think it was like 15 minutes, which is perfect because I thought that is a good amount of time. Usually when I fast forward through some of my steps, it's because, you know, the look's gonna take an hour and I don't wanna have you guys sitting here for an hour. So this worked out perfectly. Let me know in the comment section below if you guys like this in-depth step-by-step tutorial for eye looks or even different looks or maybe, you know, full face like step by step. Let me know in the comment section below and I will be sure to give that a go. Also, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy this eye look or if you enjoy these kinds of videos, subscribe to my channel. And um, yeah, today we're gonna be using the Chocolate Gold Palette by Too Faced and let's just head right into the video. Hope you guys enjoy. Dipping into the palette, I'm going to start with the shade Rollin' in Dough, and I'm going to set my entire lid. Next, I'm in, going to dip into the shade So Bougie. I'm going to pack that into the crease on a fluffy shader brush. Next, I'm going to take a smaller shader brush and I'm going to dip into Cocoa Truffle. And I'm going to fixate that more precisely in my crease. Just in windshield washer, windshield wiper motions. I'm going to buff that out a little bit. I'm going to take my other brush and kind of blend that out up top. Next, I'm going to take a smaller brush and I'm going to dip into the shade Cocoa Truffle again and really fixate that on the outer corner. So this is what the eye is looking like right now. Taking that definer brush also, I'm going to dip into the black shade called Decadence. I'm going to fixate that right on the very outer portion. It really is all about building up the color. Sometimes I'll start by patting it. My eyelashes are like brown color. And 
and work it into the crease a little bit. And that's where it stands right now. Next, we're going to grab some concealer and we're going to do a half cut crease. I'm going to grab a brush, some concealer, do a half cut crease, and we're going to try to do it pretty. Okay, so that's what we got. So I'm not going to set it. I'm just going to get a packer brush and just start packing these shades on top. Spritz our brush with some Fix Plus and go into the shade called Dipped. Now we're going to move into the shade Famous. Pack that onto the center of the lid. And then I'm going to dip into the shade Love and Cocoa. I'm going to go with my hand, my finger. Just press that in. So I'm going to dip into the first shade. And Famous. There's a little bit of fallout. It's looking pretty cool. I'm going to go back into the shade Chocolate Truffle. Just kind of Blend that in. Then I'm also going to dip into Decadence. And just with a little bit of Love and Cocoa. Blend that in. And actually the, the inside shade is looking a little um a little bland. I'm going to dip into the shade 
chocolate gold. Just pop that in between famous and gold dipped. I'm gonna just dust off so this is what we have for the eye look right now let me pop on some lashes then we can get to working on the lower lash line so I just popped on some lashes these are the um, accent Lashes by Ardell, they're basically half lashes. So I use a little bit of tart glue and I pop those on along with the um, Better Than Sex Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. So I'm just gonna dust off. I had a little bit of bake under my eye. Let's finish off the lower lash line. I'm gonna zoom you guys back in. So here we have the eye up close. I'm going to take A little brush and I'm going to smudge the shade Cocoa Truffle along the lower lash line. I'm going to connect that. Next, I'm going to spray my brush with some Max Fix, Mac Fix Plus, and I'm going to jump into the black shade Decadence, and I'm going to smoke out that corner even more. And connect. Then I'm going to dip into the shade So Bougie and just diffuse that a little bit. Okay. Then I'm going to take my brush, I'm going to spritz it with Mac Fix Plus and I'm going to take the shade Chocolate Gold. And I'm really going to pack that on. And I'm going to grab chocolate truffle, blend that in a little bit. And then I'm going to go into this shade called Rich Girl. Not a pencil brush, I'm going to put that in the inner corner. So these are the eyes. This is what they look like. I'm going to go ahead and finish my face and I'll be right back. So this is the finished eye look using the Too Faced Chocolate Gold palette. And I must say, this is one of my favorite Too Faced palettes. There are just so many great, great shades in this. Not to mention, the packaging itself is stunning. Um, it smells great because it smells like chocolate. And just, it has enough shades in here that are wearable and then it has these pops of color so oh my gosh look it's so like shiny so it really messes with my lighting but it has these four matte shades right here so this is the bone shade this is the, a crease shade a deeper or like a transition shade the crease shade and a black a matte black so it's a matte black matte brown and then a good transition shade and a good 
bone color. And then all these are shimmers, and they're just so stunning. Um, and I really like the look that I came up with today. I think this is a fantastic palette. I bought this in the fall, and I think it's my favorite fall palette. The shimmers in here are just so rich and shiny, and they're just really, really pretty. And I stuck with a nice, um, I don't want to say neutral look, but it's just, it, it's a look that is wearable um, for everyone. So people who are like afraid of bright, bold colors, but still want glitter. Um, this is a nice, it goes from a champagne to a gold, to a bronze, to a black. And I really like the way this eye look came out. Uh, the shades blend together beautifully. And this is just really a great palette. So if you're asking me about a good, good, Too Faced palette, then this is really, really a great one if you're into shimmers. Um, but it's it's nice because it's not just shimmers, so they don't just leave you high and dry with only shimmers and then you have to dip into other palettes uh, to make a finished look. This is a very great, well-rounded palette. And for a person who loves shimmers, like this is great. You can create your own looks. And I like that it's got all these very warm, you know, these very warm shades, but it's also got a green, a very like icy blue, this pink, um, this purple. It ha it's a very, very diverse palette. I think they really did a great job with this and I am thoroughly enjoying it. It's a great palette. So I hope you guys enjoyed this eye look. Um, I certainly enjoyed putting it together. Um, be sure to hit that like button down below if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to my channel. Check out some of my other videos over here. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.